Jeremy and Taylor. They did not believe they met by chance. They believed that God directed them to be in the same place at the same time. And it's God's will that they would find each other to stay and be married. A good marriage must be created. In marriage, the little things are big things. It's important to say, I love you, at least once a day. Love means never going to sleep angry. It is important that you have shared values and common objectives. Remember, you will never be too old to hold hands. Love means standing together and facing the world. It is forming a circle that gathers in your whole family. It is speaking words of appreciation and demonstrating gratitude in thoughtful ways. It is important to forgive and forget. Love is giving each other the support you need to grow. It is not about marrying the right person. It's about being the right person every day. My marriage prayer for this is that you will always remember the qualities that attracted you to each other's when you first met. and how you felt as your feelings of attraction turned into respect, admiration, and love. That you will work hard to turn your feelings of love into acts of love so that nothing and no one can divide you. That you will always have kind and loving hearts that are quick to ask for forgiveness when you are wrong, and as well as forgive when your partner is wrong. In his letter to the Corinthians, Paul reminds us that love bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, and endures all things. I pray that each of you has committed to place your marriage in God's hands so that your love will increase and overflow beyond anything you can imagine. Friends, family, and my God, I, Jeremy, take you, Taylor, to be my wife. Before friends, family, and my God, I, Taylor, take you, Jeremy, to be my husband. I promise to be true to you in good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. I will love you and I will honor you all the days of my life. All the days of my life. 
by Taylor promise to be fair, to be honest and available for you. I promise to love and respect you. I will cherish my life with both of you. On this day, when I marry your daddy, I marry you. I promise to love and support you as my own. You guys know Jeremy, you know how much he likes to talk on the phone. So I texted him and I said, What is your favorite thing about Taylor? He said, uh, Her heart. She's the most caring, considerate, and loving person I know. He said, uh, Her commitment to me and my daughter. He said, Her optimistic approach to life. She has an innate, innate ability to see the best in people point is Jeremy's found this beautiful woman inside and out to spend the rest of his life with I couldn't be more happy for them Taylor from from the day that you told me about Jeremy it was obvious that he was a special guy and more importantly a special guy to you as I've watched you two guys become close I think of how much joy you both have ahead of you and how much joy you'll share together. I didn't think that I would ever be able to, for another man to be good enough for TJ. But it's my joy and I'm proud to say that she found a man that will respect and honor her with all that she deserves.